All right, the layout of the wheels for your Canon. Now this is a good example of what not to do. This person has them either too thin or too big. Now if you're gonna have two that are too big, put them on the back, you know, like a car where they got the fat tires on the back, that looks good, you know, it's symmetrical. Uh, and then here again is how your Canon should not go. It should be these two bands should be even with this top part here. So this whole thing needs to be unscrewed. But again, this is something that somebody left because they know they did it wrong. But we don't care. We want to make these wheels. So you start out with this aluminum bar stock, round bar stock. And we want to make them each um, quarter is pretty thick. Yeah, I guess we'll do them a quarter. The eighth is too thin, see, because by the time you machine them down, they look too thin. So we'll go with the quarter. I'd rather they look better and I buy some more aluminum. So we set it up at a quarter. We put a line, which is two of these eighths, two eighths, two eighths. Yeah, that's right, because you use one inch of material. Now, the deal is you don't want to drill the holes after the fact. If you can use a drill bit and drill the holes first, that's better. So we're going to drill at least past an inch, and then we're going to cut these off with the parting tool. That's right, because when you cut it with the parting tool, you'll cut right in the center there. You're going to lose some material for the thickness of the actual parting tool. And so they'll be less than a quarter of an inch will, will be perfect. And that's how you lay out your wheels for your cannon.